Like a bell cut. Sergio Ramos, Real Madrid, in 2020. 8 goals, 1 assist, 9 clean sheets. 1 La Liga and Supercopa de España. Real Madrid's first Spanish title since 2017 was built on a defense that was marshaled superbly by Ramos as he enjoyed his most consistent campaign for some time. It was his goal-scoring exploits towards the end of the season, though, that moved him up this list as he found the net on a number of occasions during the run-in. Erling Haaland, Borussia Dortmund, in 2020, 16 goals, 3 assists. The breakthrough star of the season, Holland has taken to top-level football better than almost anyone in the last decade, with the Norwegian a relentless goal-scoring machine. Dortmund's failure to reach the latter stages of the Champions League means he cannot be any higher on the list, but he certainly made a strong case otherwise. Thomas Muller, Bayern Munich, in 2020, 7 goals, 12 assists. One Bundesliga and DFB Pokal Muller seemed to be on his way out of Bayern during the first half of the season as he struggled to make much of an impact under Niko Kovac. The Crotian sacking and the subsequent hiring of Hansi Flick, however, gave the Germanal a new lease of life as he helped turn the Bavarians' campaign around and make them into the favourites to win the champion. Kylian Mbappé Paris Saint-Germain, in 2020, 12 goals, 8 assists. 1 League 1. Mbappe's chances of claiming a first Ballon d'Or were boosted recently after PSG found themselves in the easier side of the Champions League draw, with Atalanta and one of Atletico Madrid or RB Leipzig standing between them in a European final. The decision to play both domestic French Cup finals also plays into his hands, with the League 1 champion suddenly on course to win a quadruple after five months with no games. Kevin De Bruyne of Manchester City, in 2020, 6 goals, 8 assists. 1 Carabao Cup. The standout individual performer in the Premier League this term, De Bruyne is blameless when it comes to Man City's failure to defend their title this term. His performance at Santiago Bernabeu to beat Real Madrid has left Pep Guardiola's side in a strong position to advance to the last eight, meaning he still had the chance to close the gap on the Ballon d'Or favourites. Neymar, Paris Saint-Germain, in 2020, 9 goals, 4 assists. 1 League 1. Will Neymar ever get a better chance to win the Ballon d'Or? The Brazil star led PSG past Dortmund in the last 16 of the Champions League, is in a team chasing a quadruple and faces a path to the Champions League final that does not contain any of Europe's big hitters. Maybe the ex-Barcelona is destined not to win football's biggest individual honour. Karim Benzema, Real Madrid, in 2020, 10 goals, 4 assists. 1 La Liga and Supercopa de España. The leading light in Madrid's title success, Benzema is enjoying the best prolonged spell of form of his career in the Spanish capital. Despite a dry spell over the winter, he still ended the campaign with 21 league goals, and will be crucial in turning around their Champions League tie with Man City. Lionel Messi, Barcelona, in 2020. 15 goals, 17 assists. The top scorer in La Liga, the most assists ever in La Liga and more goal contributions in 2020 than any other player on this list, and yet Messi finds himself in third. The Ballon d'Or holders' chances of claiming a seventh prize were hit by both Barcelona's failure to win La Liga and their poor form meaning they likely would have needed to raise their game hugely to challenge for the Champions League. Cristiano Ronaldo, Juventus, in 2020, 20 goals, 5 assists. Before last week's draw with Sassuolo, Ronaldo had either scored or assisted in every one of Juventus' Serie A matches in 2020 as they march almost unopposed towards another Scudetto. Failure to win the Coppa Italia and being behind against Lyon in their Champions League last 16 tie means Ronaldo cannot top the list right now, but he would certainly be in the running for the top prize if it were being awarded. And now the number one Robert Lewandowski, Bayern Munich, in 2020, 21 goals, 4 assists. One Bundesliga and DFB Pokal. No player can feel more hard done by when it comes to the decision to cancel the Ballon d'Or than Lewandowski. 
The Poland International has been in blistering form in 2020, having fired Bayern to a domestic double while helping make them the favorites to win the Champions League. At the age of 31, he may not get a better chance of claiming the ultimate individual prize. And now by take care see you in the next video. To stay up to date with the latest and cool videos by Watch and Tell Corporation, make sure to subscribe to this channel by clicking the subscribe button. And here is a cute warning for you like and leave a comment for me.